What's up guys? Baker here. I've got a tutorial. This is going to be the uh, camo color change and it's basically this example I have in my um, Myth 20k Team Taj and you can see the uh, color of this camo is changing and looks pretty cool. I'm sure there's been tutorials on it before but I'm just going to show you my method and um, hopefully you guys will like it. So here's my example. Just changing colors, kind of bright, kind of glowy. I like it. Pretty, pretty cool and nifty, I think. And um, you can do tons of other things. You don't have to do a color change, but I'll show you the basics. So let's go ahead and delete this. Make sure your clip is pre-composed so you can uh, sync with it afterwards. And you need to have this camo. I think it's Cyborg, but I don't have... Um, Black Ops 2 or any of the new games so just uh, have this kind of camo thing and let's just duplicate our clip and you don't have to but I have sharpened to make the clip a little bit more clear go ahead and just search up a simple color key now you can use um, key light or whatever keying thing you want let's actually solo this layer as well and we're going to uh, color drop the yellow down here so just yellow and nothing really happens, but if we turn up the tolerance, you should see that the yellow starts to uh, go away a little bit. So that looks pretty good. What we're going to do is go to uh, invert, channel invert, drag that on, and invert the alpha channel. So this basically brings back everything we just keyed. So we don't want um, this little bar or whatever, so we can turn down the tolerance again and the edge thin will uh, kind of increase the size after after we key it. So let's zoom in here. Let's go to full res. So maybe edge thin, like one pixel, and just kind of play with the threshold until uh, you get something okay. So if we don't get everything on the gun, that's fine. Just make sure we don't have any uh, huge pieces flying out. If you want, you can just uh, take your pen tool and mask out the general area of the gun and just do a simple a couple simple keyframe mask path uh, just to get this general area and uh, feather it out you know so but that isn't necessary too much as long as your threshold is at a, a good value so we have our gun here so what I'm gonna do is just uh, add a hue and saturation boom and just go from one point keyframe the channel range, go to another point and just crank up this wheel a couple spins and you should see that our camo is now blue, turns to purple, pink, all that cool stuff. So we can either just unsolo it and just have it laid on top but it looks a little too you know fake, a little too sharp so what we can do is add a glow, quick glow on top and maybe increase the radius just a tiny bit so it gets a little bit brighter that looks pretty cool, blends a little bit so you can either keep this on a normal transfer mode if you want the colors to really stand out I don't know if you want to rotate it or just keep it one color but you can also just set this to add and it also looks really good because it's even brighter and looks like it's actually glowing out of the gun I think it blends a little bit nicely but you still we'll be able to see the uh, yellow orange camo before a little bit so kind of up to you um, I think it looks cool you can also add things like shine which I didn't but you can and just uh, set it to add and just play with the point and increase the boost light maybe so you can have light coming out of just the yellow parts of the camo that looks pretty cool so you can do pretty much anything you want with this. You're basically isolating the colors of the camo, changing them, whatever you want. Kind of like a selective, what did uh, Andrew call it? Selective color king or something. I don't know. Anyways, if you make any cool examples, be sure to uh, post your link in the description or uh, in the comments and stuff. Be sure to like and favorite the video. Comment if you have any other questions. Hit me up on Facebook and Twitter. All that good stuff. I think that's about it. Um, yeah. Alright, peace.